Hey guys, okay, this is another video. Um, this is a makeup tutorial for beginners, so like we are trying to learn makeup. So, this is something easy, something you have to can wear every day. So, it's just you looking like yourself, like you have no makeup at all, but just a bold lip and you look super glam. So, without further ado, let's get on to the video. <laughs> hey guys, okay, so here I'm doing my brows. Uh, I'm using the Davis eye pencil in color three. Yeah, so um, I'm just lining the brows from the down area to the top. So I line my brows first before I fill it in. So I'm lining them. After lining, I start filling. Then I feel like in hair like strokes. Just according to the way my brow grows. That's just it basically. I'm concealing now with the LA Girl Pro Conceal. In the shade phone so I'm concealing the I actually majorly concealed the um, under of my brows I don't like doing the top I don't know why it's just stressful and this is easy for people that do not just want to stress themselves to outline the top of their brows so just draw your brows really well with your pencil then clean up the bottom so that's what I'm doing now Then I'm blending everything in with my beauty blender. You know, feeling like, <laughs> never mind. Yeah, I'm showing you guys my dance steps. You know, I'm a good dancer. You know what I'm I'm just a good dancer, I know. So I'm applying my primer, the NYX primer. Then I'm using my concealer to just conceal the spots I have on my the side of my cheeks and the dark spot on my eyelid. So it looks like to give me a really clean base just to start my makeup and apply foundation. So I'm using my beauty blender to blend it all in. Then right now I'm using my foundation, the black up foundation. The color five, I think. Yeah, I think it's five. Yeah, the color five. So I'm blending it in. I love this foundation actually. It just blends in so well and it's really matte. And it's like you applying another layer of skin entirely. So I apply more, you know, just to the parts that they really get the foundation. And I'm blending everything in with my beauty blender. You know, makeup is blending, so you guys have to blend very well. Make sure you blend every single thing seamlessly. So right now, I've just highlighted the spots on my face that I want to pop. That's my the upper part of my cheek, my forehead, my nose, the jawline. So I'm blending everything in with my beauty blender. I blend this part really well because this is like the hardest part to blend into it. So I blend really, really well. You know, dancing, listen to the vibes, you know, flowing. So blending it in. You know, just be comfortable. Most importantly, you have to be comfortable. You have to be in a comfortable place when you're doing your makeup. If not, you'll make a lot of mistakes. So right now, I'm using the mini star. Um, just doing the light contour on my face. Parameters on my face. So I'm blending it really well with my powder brush. You know, everything is just blending, guys. So just blend well. This is a really 
easy makeup look that anybody can do your mom your sister your brother you know it's it's something easy just then I'm going in with lighter shade and I use the same brush that I use for the contour because I don't like my highlight being too bright so I don't change brushes I use the same brush that I use for the contour to do my highlights so I'm using a really dark contour shade to do my eyeshadow you know I want it to look normal like I didn't apply so many things on my face it's like it's an easy everyday makeup look so I'm blending it in with my Bobbi Brown blending brush and I'm lining my eyes the eyeliner will be listed in the description box because I can't remember then I'm using the naked mascara to just you know make my lashes pop because I'm not applying any forces this is like a natural look then I apply setting spray just to like let everything soak into my skin then lastly the lip so so I'm using the Huda matte lipstick I'm lining my lips first I always line my lips first to give it the shape first before filling it in with the same shade so that's just basically what I'm doing here bringing out the shape of my lips then going into the same lipstick and filling it in and I felt like it looked too dark so I got this other color that is slightly lighter so I put it in the middle part of my lips so yeah so that's how it came out I was feeling myself, yeah, I feel like a good as hair. <laughs> so, that was the video. I hope you guys liked it. Follow me on Instagram at Maria B. Follow me on Snapchat. Usuals, the usuals, you know, they'll be in the description box. You know, just check below, okay? So, I love you guys. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Subscribe to my channel, okay? Tell your friends. Let your friends tell their friends, okay? Just tell people, okay?